Hello Capricorn and welcome. Let's see what we have for you for the weekend. This is for Capricorn Sun, Moon Rising and Venus, so I hope you're well. As always, take what resonates, won't be for everyone. So let's see what we have for our lovely Capricorns. Thank you. We have people, number seven, professional assistance. And we have status quo, number two, cycle. Let's see what we have with that. I am using the Morgan Greer deck. What do we have for Capricorn? Thank you, Angel Spirits Guides, for the weekend. And these readings can resonate a few days longer than when they're released. So let's see what we have for our lovely Capricorns. Thank you for the weekend. Ten of Pentacles. Oh my goodness, the Ten of Cups. The, these are the two best tens. <laughs> we have the Nine of Wands. And the Knight of Swords. You've been assisted here. Again, this could be business or professional. It could be in terms of health here as well, Capricorn. I feel... It could also be about seeking professional assistance in relationships too. So however that resonates for you, uh, because the cards can link with those areas. The Nine of Wands is, is you've persevered. You've persevered. A, a process has not been easy, but you're near the end of a process now. And I feel because you've been assisted... This is all, it's always darkest before the dawn, but the end is closer than you think, and there's change coming your way. It looks in the form of the Knight of Swords. Knight of Swords can be communication, can be incoming. So very good in terms of finally you can release from a situation that has been testing and the norm being restored here. A change within a cycle where you just feel that sense of norm and everything falling into place and being happy and fulfilled again. You know... Again, if this is news coming into you, this can be about potentially overcoming a health issue. This could be for you personally or somebody who you've been supporting through a difficult time and it's been exhausting. Similarly, this can also be a situation here. It could be in a work scenario. Again, the sense of long-term stability and security returning to the home, the family, the relationship. So this can have a financial flavor with the Ten of Pentacles. Not always. If it's about the relationship itself here, Capricorn, this would be an energy here of that sense of getting back on a stable footing. It's a long-term committed relationship marriage and it might well be you went through a testing period and you needed professional help. But the again, the Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups, it's just all falling into place. This is the rainbow after the rain, most definitely in a reading in terms of whichever life area rep is represented for you. I love these two tens being together because where you were near the end of a process, it feels like then it just all falls into place and that stability and security, whether it's emotional or financial, um, the sense of that is restored. Again, if it's about a relationship, the Knight of Swords will be a heart-to-heart -heart conversation. And again, even getting professional help or advice in terms of speaking, talking things through, therapy, therapy sessions, and finally everything coming back to that sense of status quo and equilibrium. And that will be the advice as well. If you're in that situation, it might well be some kind of professional help is needed or might be advantageous for you in any life area. So let's see what we have for Capricorn. We have giraffe, the bigger picture. Take a step back and gather your thoughts and feelings. Yeah. Just a sense of, of bringing everything back into perspective. And finally, you know, uh, seeing that way forward. I'm, it just feels like everything's just falling back into place here. That sense of the rainbow after the rain. Something feels like it's tested you, but then it just all falls back into harmony, stability, security. Yeah, it's just lovely. That's what I have for you. I hope you enjoyed your reading. If you did, please do like, share and subscribe. I wish you a wonderful weekend. I will see you next time.